All right, hello and welcome to my very special playthrough of Trials of Mana. This game meant a lot to me as a kid. I remember playing through most of it on the uh, SNES or on a on a little bit with my friends. We had a two-player playthrough. As far as I know, this game is not two-player. I had to check a few things to make sure my camera was in the right place. And uh... oh yeah, I'm going with hard. And I had to make sure a lot of things were uh, set in motion. I know this demo will carry over to the full game, so I think it'll only let you go as far as level 7. Now, whenever I initially played, I'm not going to lie, the picture on the, uh, the fine art, or on the thumbnail, should have told you exactly who I'm going to pick here. It's who I played when I was a kid, and I, I will try not to reference too many other things that happened back in the uh, original game. Because they might have changed a few things here. I like Hawk. Hawk and Reese have a lot of uh, similarities between who they have here, and uh, this person looks like they're dressed for battle. Oh, nobody is, an is as annoying as Charlotte. Little baby. Alright, we're gonna go with Angela. It's gonna up my views so much. No, I'm just playing. But yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna be trying out this. Definitely, uh... Now, it'll be on the back burner until it releases on the 24th of this month of April, the 2020. But after that point... But after that point, we're going to be rocking out with it. Um, I do have Japanese subtitles on so that I can kind of just like talk over stuff and have like... Uh, not mind flood people too badly if they're listening to many things at once. I can give you the cliff notes of stuff right now. I mean... Reese is just kind of like uh, protecting her village or like showing how she's the uh, showing how she's the uh, the leader of this group weak attacks okay that's not B on the uh, that's a jump okay there we go that's the quick attack I believe I learned this that's X power attack oh I believe I tried to charge that. Yes, that's exactly what I did. Oh, hello. <gasps> that's the percentages. Okay, okay, okay. L, B, and X. Ah, oh, and it shows the faces too. Oh, nice. A lot of this feels really good so far. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. That is, of course, I did it. Famously said by Chun Li in Street Fighter 2. But yeah, they're having just a little bit of a monster issue. And I believe her village is like special in some kind of way because of its wind power. Dude, RPGs used to be my thing when I was growing up as a kid. On the Super NES, on the PlayStation 1, on the NES. Huge fan. Could not picked a better game to come out right after Final Fantasy 7 it's gonna get me back into that feel of like a true RPG now mind you I will be editing these videos to get rid of a lot of um, a lot of like the buying and the uh, selling of gear and you know all the making my stats exactly what I want them to be and picking back up after I get out of like an inn or an armory shop or stuff like that just so that you can guys can see me react to the story beats and see me react to like all the character development. Yeah, where's your Ototo-san? Where's your, where's your little brother? Sorry, I did take Japanese for about two years, so my Japanese is pretty terrible. Uh, excuse me, how do I talk to these people? Welcome back, Captain. Like I said, she is the captain, showing off her abilities and her skills to... Uh, Excuse me? I don't have a double jump? Hmm. Mana stones in the caves. That's not going to come in handy at all later on. Oh my word. Please, woman. Oh, I have a dash. And I got an item seed. That's nice. Okay. I have like an air combo? I have like a regular combo. Oh, 
Oh no! Are you kidding me? Excuse me? Are these like uh? We got Dynasty Warriors up in here. I'll take it. I like Dynasty Warriors. This is how I sprint. This is how I win. Puppy dog sound. I can't pet him. It's a little sad. Oh, no one is allowed beyond this point. Okay. That must be their sacred temple. And now I've locked myself in here. Luker! If you've ever played the Secret of Mana series, that's their money. At least it should be their money. What do we got going on inside here? What you got for me? Perhaps you should ask Alma where the little prince is. Should be in his room on the right of the throne. Okay, what do we got over here though? I believe those are the save symbols. That should be a save and heal because it's gold. The regular save symbols should be just silver. <gasps> Candies. Oh, item ring and move ring. Hold RB to make a shortcut for things. For items. Let's make this down. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. All allies HP. No, no, no. Let's put the candies down there instead. Moves. So I can get to moves by pressing down. I don't have any moves. But what is this one called? That's not a move? That doesn't count? A little rude. I do like the green. I think it matches everything else around here going on right now because everything is kind of green. <gasps> you got something for me? Another item seed. Well, very well, very well. I left that here earlier. Just coming back around to pick it up. This was mine to begin with. That's not how you jump. Ooh, and more money. We need more money. Now let's go upstairs. Oh, yes. Big jumps. Really excited to see how they play on this and if the... I'm going to make this map bigger. Whoa. Okay, select. Not that. Not the other button, but select. This should be main door. I'm really excited to see how they play on this and make like a... Uh, a different characters feel different in their own storylines. There should be three main storylines. One for each of the pairs. One for... Charlotte and ooh, chocolate this early? Are you kidding me? One for Charlotte and what is that guy's name? Charlie? Can't remember his name right now. I feel like it's something very straightforward and boring like that. Then there's one for Durant and one for oh excuse me? Nobody's allowed allowed beyond that point either. What's up there? Oh no, I don't remember that. Yeah, one for Angela and Durant, and then one for Hawk and uh Reese. You got for me. Yeah, where's the brother at? You know, he doesn't look blind. Most feel like he doesn't have, you know, that glazed over effect that they normally do for blind people in games or for media. Where they just have like white upon white, as if that's what blind people's eyes look like. Yeah, it's time for training. Where could he be? Go to Alma. Okay, Alma should be right over here. Perfect. That's where the star is. But of course, wherever an RPG wants us to go is the exact opposite of where you should go. If I've learned anything from RPGs in all my day, it's search everywhere else first. That way you don't get locked out of missing something that you should have uh, gotten on your first pass through. Hello. This looks like a bedroom. Are you? His Majesty King Joster has been troubled by the wind as of late. I haven't noticed any changes myself. Mm, he thinks a bad omen is going to happen at the start of an RPG? That would never. I don't have a double jump. I don't have like an air. Oh, I have like an air roll. That's interesting. I don't think this does anything else. I don't think the attack is very good, I'm not gonna lie. That little spike down doesn't seem very, uh, very strong here. <gasps> Couple wishes! That should be like a Phoenix Down or a Revive. 
Yeah, it was the little one. You're his keeper. Uh oh. So you thought he was with me. I thought he was with you. And now we're in trouble. So far, a lot of this music sounds very similar to what it was back in the old days, too. Hmm. It's the tragedy of being a RPG hero, losing your parents, especially with any uh, RPG that came out in the 90s. Oh, no. Why do they both have bowl cuts? That was the first thing I noticed. She had like that straight ridge and so did he. Interesting that she only found respite at that same cliff that's now being attacked by monsters. She's still very young in this game as far as I know. What a what a kid, huh? She is the very like vision of a Valkyrie whenever you hear that word though, right? Like the wings on the on the headgear using a spear long flowing hair like she's lived forever it looks like she's never cut it now that i'm thinking about it i'm really glad he doesn't have a bo a bowl cut anymore purple swirling mist never anything bad happened out of this <laughs> Bill and Ben. I almost said Bill and Ted. He's trying to play off like a magician when he's obviously a ninja. Look at that squirrel on his back. Kage no bushi no jutsu. He says it's a clone. He even made all the hand symbols and everything. Yeah, that's how magic works. I don't know how old the little brother's supposed to be, though. He looks like he couldn't be much older than, like, seven or eight-ish. Fairly young. What you got? Did you have business here? You won't believe His Highness has come through here. Or you don't believe he's come through there. I still can't go up here? Interesting. I thought for sure they would have allowed me to go up there. Huh. Oh, back down then. Oh, and I got another lady over here. What do we have over here? Why would you have these inside? Shouldn't you have like lanterns inside instead of these things? gonna burn down the castle also anytime I see any of these big huge like uh, white containers back here I always think of milk I don't know why you haven't seen his highness either yeah he should know it's training time why does she immediately think he went under the citadel he was playing near the underground passage he seemed to have, have a friend with him like he was talking to somebody well, this isn't gonna end well. And the guard's gone, of course. Is that an item up there? No, it's a red bird. Holy crap. Almost didn't even see him. I'm really I, I got super lucky that my camera position just happens to work out for this game as well as uh one step from Eden. Yeah, where's the little brother at? Tricks are for kids. Staying hydrated. Now staying hydrated is for adults. Yeah, you already lied to this child once before? I'll believe you again if you just show me some magic.
Huh. I mean, obvious bad dude is obvious. But I wonder if other people's, like, uh, starting story has this kind of naivete in it. Yeah, this is how we control the winds around uh, our city. <laughs> oh my word. Child. Well, I guess he wouldn't have been like subjected to all the movies and tropes that we have, but still. Are we going to have to chase after him this whole game? What are they going to do here? Are they going to kill him? Am I going to have to revenge for it? What do you want me to do? I can already see all the bad things coming from this. Yeah, they'll bring back your mom. All kinds of cool magic tricks. Of course she would say that. Yeah, see? Part of this might be that I played this like 20 years ago? Maybe like 15 to 20 years ago? Look, revealing my age is, uh, is a big no-no. Mm -hmm. Definitely easy to say I didn't play this whenever I was like, you know, four though. So that should give you a little hint. Come on, there's one staircase going down, lady. You don't have to, like, really look for him. It's not like it's a maze down there. Are they at least going to show him his mom? Because that's the one thing that gets me about villains. Oh, they do have, like, fire magic. They didn't even have to make any symbols that time. They didn't have to do any, like... Gang signs or anything, yeah? This ain't it, chief. I know memes. Oh, now you realize that you've been tricked. The Varlin forces, huh? They're just waiting for the wind to stop right outside the door? You don't have a nation? Interesting. You can just call yourselves in like a country, steal a nation right when your nation is going under and be like, yeah, 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 yeah. like it's a game of risk. Well, that's trouble. Oh, you're... No. No, come on. Wait, is my brother going to hate me? He's going to be like, I go to save him and he's like... Omae wa mo shinderu? You know what I mean? Like, you're already dead? That kind of thing? Or maybe not. Maybe they're just going to hostage him in case they need him. Just go back for him. It'll be fine. Hold on, I'm going to save here real quick. Oh, we got a banger? This is the same music from the SNES version. Should be the same, uh, like, battle music. Yes, silver and gold. Same as it was before, gold restores MP and HP. You can also save progress at an end. I like that. Let's go with this. And we'll go over that. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah, the rest of it was me trying out, like I said earlier, um, making sure my sound worked, making sure my camera was in a good place, and I was like, oh, never mind, this all works perfectly. We don't have to worry about anything. 
or like my controller not working or anything like that. I don't really know about the combo system. I figured she could probably start back up the crystal, but I didn't expect to get like a cutscene. That's actually really cool. Let's go. How do you not play as the Valkyrie in this game? Come on. Well, I guess some the the standard thing would be to like you know just make me the knight or make me the mage. Oh, we got pan flutes. I like pan flute every now and then. Save King Jostra. Okay, I got a little bit of a quest log on the right too. It's a really cool symbol up there. I don't know about this room, but that's a really cool symbol. This is like the octagon. Come in and get beat. Whoa. That's a lot of fire. You gonna try and save everybody? Oh, okay. They're not actually dead. They're just like knocked out. You just knock everybody out, kill the leader, and then run away? I guess that's like the more, you know, if you could just win a battle by killing one guy instead of destroying their whole way of life. Oh shoot, there's ninjas over here. Okay. Repel attack? Area? Ah, I'm trying to read. Area attack. Okay, so you can kind of throw them back. Okay. Her 1, 2, 3 combo, she doesn't seem to do like a ton of damage right now. Okay, nothing seems to have respawned. What about the dog? Anybody know about the dog that was over here? We're cute looking. Can't talk to you. <gasps> Item. A little bit of money. Oh, this lady's dead too. Maybe they're just asleep. I need to stop assuming that they're all like dead, but maybe some of them have items. Never mind. Okay, this is, this has turned out to be a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. We're not even taking like all that much ah HP damage either. I think I'm more used to games having the HP on the left and the mana on the right, but this this is gonna be okay. This is totally fine. Okay, we're ah, more ninjas. Oh, the AoE doesn't push them back. No, it just kind of taps everybody. So the one-two might be the better of the combos. Oh, level up. What you got for me? Oh. HP and stats. Okay. It's like normal. Training points. Moves and abilities. Put points towards abilities. From the training section of the menu. Excuse me? Use the training points to obtain you obtain after leveling up to learn moves and abilities and increase your stats. Moves, magic spells, and attacks you learn will automatically be added to the move ring. Pressing down will bring up the menu and select a move while exploring the field or battling using moves cost MP. Um, increasing stats. Increase your base HP, MP, strength, stamina, and intellect. Spirit and or luck stats. Abilities will grant you special bonuses to help you on your adventure. Equipping an ability equip an ability to get the bonus effect. Abilities with the buddy icon next to them are chain abilities. When equipped, these abilities will affect other party members in addition to the player character. Okay. Can I like look at these abilities? I just want to be able to like look at what they do though before I say yes that I want to have them. Fortitude increases attack by 15% when affected by status effects. Base stamina increased by 5. Base strength increased by 5. 5% 5 chance of canceling out damage from a opponent. Victory CS boost. Add 5% to the CS gauge when an enemy is defeated. I don't know what quick heal does, but I feel like that's going to be good as well as interception. I do want this character to be more like a, uh, a buffing 
tank, and I think that's int and stamina and a little bit of strength. Although you don't really, like, I wish I could move this other thing. Oh, there it is. Damage dealt by enemy target. Damage dealt by enemy targeting the player decreased by 5%. That's good. Quick heal status effect time shortened by 30%. Okay, that's not what I thought quick heal would do. Payback reduces the total amount of CS gauge used by 10% when using a class strike. Interesting. Chance of critical hit increased by 10%. Interesting. Encounter. Attack increases by 10% for 30 seconds when receiving damage. Effect cannot overlap. I think we're actually going to go with stamina then. Yeah, proceed from there. Base stamina increase. I don't have other people. And fortitude is for like everybody apparently. And same with pinpoint. So crit chance. That's probably going to be a real good thing to get on her then. Especially having the ninja in my in my uh, my party as well. Oh, okay. The AOE did a good chunk to both of them there. Man, they make you go through all that just to get to the just to get to the uh, save point too, huh? Hmm. With my regular attacks doing nine or eight or ten. <gasps> There's bonus EXP for doing well in battles. But with my basic attacks doing 8, 9, or 10, I wonder how much my fully charged uh, heavy attack will do? Let's see. Can we get this? Can we get this? 23? Wow. Okay, and that was a crit. Any of these? I can't talk to you. I can't talk to you guys, you guys over here. You know, if these flames were on these things, that's what it would have been like if you were to try to light those things up. It would have been a whole nother fire in here. Funny how they're actually like burning these people, but they're not burning like, oh, okay. But they're not trying to burn like, uh, the people outside, just the people inside, huh? Get out of here. That's actually the easiest way to go about that. Oh, I forgot about abilities. I forgot about abilities. Yeah, that guy ate it. That might be a little bit too strong. Even, uh... Even on hard mode, that, like, one, two... Pretty sure the bosses are gonna eat me alive trying to do that, though. Oh. Oh. So they did get to him. They just put everybody else to sleep and then just murder the king. If you knew it was coming, maybe he didn't take the right approaches to whatever he was doing. It's like an anime protagonist. Both parents are gone. Oh, and her brother, too. I didn't even think about that. Well, he's not dead. She's got a chance. Not bad. I do rather enjoy RPGs. The storyline is like... A little predictable at the moment, but I wouldn't say it's outside of anything that, uh, I wouldn't say it's bad outside of anything I would call good. These guys look cool. I like this. They kind of remind me of the foot soldiers. Oh man, they are killing people. Holy sh- Why does she have to kill a lion? Just to have that thing. Also, I don't think that's protecting anything. This is like the other mage. Maybe she's a mage. Maybe that's what mages wear. It's very obvious where their magic is coming from. So they're killing the enemy forces, putting them to sleep the other people, and then, like, killing the king? 
<laughs> but to what end? They want to take over? Do they want to like get us out of the way? So then, you know where you're going. Man, she's got really cool looking eyes though, doesn't she? Super cool eyes. I like the way that they did it with like gradients around uh, blue to purple. That's a good touch. This is a lot more relaxing than playing One Step for Aiden where I'm like, Ah, my brain. I can't ever stop thinking or stop like trying to reiterate something that happened like half a battle ago. You get actual time to like process what the person is going through. Also, I put it on Japanese voice actors for another reason. And that's because I don't know if the English voice acting is bad. And by putting it on Japanese voice actors, I don't know if the Japanese voice acting is bad either. I don't speak Japanese well enough to know uh, if she's like overselling it or something like that. Oh, so she got the hairband from her mom. That's a nice touch. I wonder... There's a lot of clipping on that hair. I wonder if the weapons and like gear will change with armor and stuff like that. Main theme. Is that, is that it? Is that the demo? Why did I pick the other characters? Is she just like recapping what we literally just went through so we can uh, watch her ride a boat. Is that it? Are you kidding me? Well, that should be good enough for the video at least. Why does it say it'll let you get to level 7? Do you think I'm going to go back there and try and grind that out to get to level 7? Maybe some of the other starting areas have like repeat fights? Shoot, I barely got to level 2. This is more than likely the intro cutscene now that I'm thinking about it a little bit more. Give me a title screen? Title card? The fact that they brought back so many of the songs that I remember... Like redone and orchestrated to not be so uh, so MIDI is actually they actually sound really good and true to the original. Also, I like this mushroom and this uh, little rabbi. Secret of Mana was also a banger. Super NES game. Three players available, although everybody keeps eating up the freaking like uh, the little wheel icon thing that you have to use. Oh, that's a beast tribe. Okay, okay. Also to note, I am playing this on the PC. There is a, I believe, Switch version as well. Ooh. Oh. We gotta get out of here and go find your brother. Yeah, 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 yeah. But first, we gotta scour the whole town. Oh, hey, kids. The kids are scared, too, huh? She's scared. He's not scared. The mother? She doesn't seem too worried about anything. What's this? It's the end. I don't think I've taken any damage. I don't need to go to sleep. It's 
this lead to? I can just go out this way, right? Something's not right with the town. Watch yourself. Okay, but can I just like... Okay, no, I can't. <gasps> There's a chest back here. I saw you. Another cup of wishes. You know what I'm going to wish for? A cup of wishes. Now that's where you put... A little fire thing like this for for lights. You put it outside. Not inside of a castle. Those also don't break. I'm sorry. <gasps> There's stuff in there. Eek, leave me alone. Stop, I beg of you. Please. Don't hurt me. Oh, I'm stealing all their money that they threw into there. I'm <laughs> By the time I realized what I was grabbing, I was like, oh, free money. And then I was like, oh, shoot. Stealing their wishes. Also, I see a weapon shop above me. That's going to be nice. I can actually see if the weapons change. Oh, running makes this way faster. Holy crap. Oh, there's no... Like, that's the... That's I'm pretty sure that's running, and that's not running. But there is no difference for running with this or that. Rude game. Rude of you to do that to me like that. What you got, nerd? Keep your head down, you won't get hurt. Okay, that's nice of you. Do you see anything other than the uh, last guy said? Don't bark if you can't handle the bite. Can I, like... I can't. I tried. I could take him. <gasps> There's more bits up here. I don't see anything else up here we can snag. Oh, I do. It expects you to do stuff like this, too? Okay. A magic rope. Hup. Is there more coins people dropping in here? Nothing? I do see something up there, though. Interesting. This is actually one making me want to explore, and this is... Ooh. Another item seed. <gasps> I got an item seed. Oh, nice. This is what I like doing in RPGs, like trying to find, I'm not gonna, ob obviously I'm not planning on 100%ing this game, I just, you know. What kind of gamer would I be if I didn't want to try and find as many little, uh, little things as I could? Nooks and crannies here and there. Nothing. Nothing. Nothing from nothing. <gasps> I see you. Item. Little candy. All right, let's start going inside shops. See what we got. Sell me something. Oh yeah, this is the dancer. Whenever they redid the uh, Secret of Mana, they had this. They won't let you sell anything. That's kind of rude. Ah, uh, it's gonna be like that everywhere, then, isn't it? Well, I guess I kind of already gotta go here. I'm up here anyway. Let's go. Ooh. Nothing. Nothing so far. What do you got? Ah. What do you got? Might not be in my place to meddle, but you should stay inside when beastmen are around. Leave once it's dark instead. I pay less attention to the little things like guard duty at night. Did you say you want to go on a date? Oh, these two are going to hate each other. But at night they transform into animals? Don't leave the house after dark? If you're trying to leave the city, night is actually best. Okay, so they kind of lose all, like, better instincts and, like, turn into actual animals. I should lie low at the end. Okay. Well, she found a way out of here fairly quickly. Look, isn't this the guy that was yelling at everybody? Keep your head down, you won't get hurt. That's what everybody else said. You didn't even say anything fancy or nice. Excuse me, there's something back here? No? Okay, never mind. Hold on, let me go over here. I think there was another house over here. Oh, this is the weapon shop. Well, I might as well go loot out the weapon shop. I mean, I already done looted out everywhere else. <gasps> A pot with nothing in it. Must get it. Must attack. Ooh, look who it is. Give me a break. What kind of weapon shop doesn't sell weapons? Yeah. You just need a few more weapons. Oh, 
another customer. Fresh out of weapons. Beastman took them all. You know, Durant doesn't sound that bad in the uh, Japanese version so far. That's pretty good. Can't say I've got any complaints about Reese's voice actor either. Planting seeds in magic pots. If you're lucky, an item may grow. So I do have a lot of item seeds. If you find a seed, try planting it in this magic pot located near the front desk. You can grow items, equipment. Now I do remember magic pots. Let's just plant all of them. In the original game, but I don't remember them working. A watcher ring? Candy? A podo oil? I don't remember them working anything like that. I definitely don't remember them having like a level. What did it give me? A Watcher Ring. Cancels out Moogle attacks? Okay. I don't know if this is going to change her, like, arm pads either. Locked to class. Interesting. Locked abilities. Class strikes and moves. Oh, and she's got different costume costumes. Okay, interesting. What the F is this? What are you doing, nerd? You're still here sleeping? All right, I will go to bed until night as well. No charge? At least while the beastmen are in town? Ah, so I'm coming back here is what you're saying. Oh, okay. We could even get a little bit of a cutscene for it, too. Are they... Oh, okay, they don't look that much different. They do look like uh, some of the Secret of Mana guys that you fight against. The ones who like to do this, like, twirling kick of doom thing. Get you locked into a corner. Hit, 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 hit. Be really annoying. You're still not getting up, huh? You're just gonna sleep all day? It's like my wife. Sorry. Shots fired. I know. You guys gonna get out of here? They're outside of the town, too? That's kind of rude. Now's your chance. Get out of here. Now's my chance to look around the town for even more goodies. I don't see anybody anywhere. I wonder if I can get out of the town this way too. There's nothing I need here? Interesting. There's nobody anywhere else at all. I wonder if they're all at the bar. That's where people in my town go whenever night comes around. It's night time. Let's get out of here, loser. This town's caught up in a war it never wanted. It's the same story everywhere you go in the world these days. Like my homeland. What's going on? What on earth is going on? All right, let's get out of here. Let's go straight down from one water into the next. I like it so far. Peak in my interest. Whoa. Ah, okay. Rabbi forest, big area. Little rabbits and mushrooms. Now we can get to level seven. Grind it out. Head to casket. Oh. Is that supposed to be them? These little dogs? They don't, they don't have a lot of defense, I'll tell you that much. The ninjas from earlier had way more defense. Okay, let's save. And that is probably at least going to be the end of this episode. I may do another episode on this before. Before I start playing the actual game when it comes out on the 24th. Of course, thank you very much for liking the video. Thank you very much for any comments that you've given. Subscribe if you want to see more of this game whenever it does come out on the 24th, of course. And thank you as always for watching. Peace. Oh, that's not how I do that. Aha, peace again.